Here we are with Jujutsu Kaisen episode 17. So yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think, and I would say let's get to the episode. And immediate intro. <laughs> So yeah, I guess we can talk predictions right now, right? Since there's nothing else to talk about. I hope we get a Maki fight and maybe or Nobara. And then I guess we get some glimpses of Itadori, I guess. Oh yeah, there's also Megumi. I completely forgot about him. And this is someone else. There's someone else, right? There's ingredients guy, but I guess he goes after curses. And I guess that's all. Yeah, that's three, three, one. Yep, that's all. So we have three more fights and Itadori, obviously. So four fights of overall. But I guess Itadori versus Toto is the main fight. <clears throat> <coughs> that concludes everything. So yeah, we will see who fights this episode. I would hope for Nobara or Mego uh, Maki. Wrong information. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, so she's clearly at a disadvantage if she fights with a sword against a long reaching weapon, right? <clears throat> Bad matchup. Oh, here we go. Oh, I guess this episode will be some good action. So far, so good. <laughs> oh, is she doing her thing again? Simple domain, new shadow style. Oh, that's this thing. That's kind of like Brain from Overlord, right? But if Maki has a pole arm. Oh, interesting. But if Maki has a pole arm, she maybe has more reach than that, so she can't use it, maybe? Damn, the OST. <laughs> Oh, is she throwing one? So that she has to move or block? Yes. <laughs> and then a kunai? And then she attacks. Yep. Oh, boy. Oh, she is pushing her. Man, the animation this episode is good. She took a sword to mine now. <laughs> what is this raven? Oh. He... Who is this girl? Right on. Of course he does. Indeed. Oh, Yuji's cutting out. Mm hmm. My. It's 
So she's all about money. <clears throat> so are uh, maybe the Kyoto paying? Paying her to manipulate it a bit? <laughs> oh, so they have to keep tracking it. Oh. Yeah, it's just fights against the students. Oh. Oh, no water. Dang. Oh, <laughs> let's go, Nobara. Punisher. I mean, I think Nobara is cute. <laughs> I hope Nobara has enough nails. Panda. <laughs> In a monkey. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> so she can't go all out because she has to concentrate. Maki, I guess. I guess Maki isn't that category. Then what's with Maki? She's even worse. Even my disrespects Maki. <laughs> <laughs> and probably even worse. Right. Oh. 
Oh. Ooh. What the hell? Oh, the OST. Oh, she uses the nails. I guess that's all what she that's all she wanted, right? For the crystal to destroy it maybe? Yes. <laughs> oh, I love Nobara. <laughs> Have to everyone has to restrain themselves. <laughs> Squeaky hammer. <laughs> Hell yeah. Again. Oh Maki? Uh Mai? That's a bullet, right? That's some range. One might think a bullet to the face would be deadly. <laughs> but I guess since they can't protect themselves with with curse energy and that's a curse bullet, I guess. It's not deadly. Rubber bullet. She just sits there. Oh, that sucks. If this is the end of Nobara for this fight, then that sucks, man. <clears throat> Come on, Nobara. Oh, Maki's here. We will see about that. <clears throat> if this is the end for... <laughs> if this is the end of Nubara for this fight, that sucks, dude. Just a shot from distance. So I guess Maki won if she's here. Indeed she is. Damn, that sucks so much, dude. Mm hmm. I like Maki's design with the big boots, she has. I don't know, I, I just like that part. <clears throat> oh, is this a sword of the other girl she's using now? <laughs> My weapon. <laughs> Whoa! -ho -ho! Is that's why she's pissed? Because she knows that she's not bad. But all the pressure is on Mai, so she feels... So that's why she doesn't like Smucky. Because the pressure is on her and... 
but Maki has more talent maybe. So I guess this one is Maki. Yeah. I mean, she can't see it. What is she afraid of if she can't see it, right? Let's go. What a fucking douche. Okay, I guess I see where the hate is coming from a bit. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, she can make bullets. Okay, so it's more like an uh, ace in the hole. Mm -hmm. One bullet a day. Ooh, she grabbed it. And she has a nose, please. Bad ass. Dang. This was a good fight.
Oh, yeah, the jujitsu stroll. Oh, god damn it, I hate him. Uh. Such a dramatic ending, and then jujitsu stroll. Yay. I can't imagine eating cup ramen or cup noodles with milk. Okay, that was the episode. Let me know what you think. But yeah, so there are two mice now. There is M A I my and there's M E I my. <laughs> it gets confusing with two mice. Um, but okay, yeah. So the two fights I wanted to see, Nobara and Maki, both happened in one episode. So I guess next episode is uh, Megumi and Itadori. And I guess that concludes the whole thing. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed how they did Nobara very, 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 very dirty. She was winning and then out of nowhere she just gets shot in the head with a rubber bullet and is knocked out. That's so bullshit. If, sh if Mai would have come in like more personal, right? Okay, I can see it. Two against one. Fine. Um, but like this, from so far away, with one shot, that's bullshit. I don't like that. Um, and yeah, I guess Maki won the first fight off screen, pretty much. Because, or maybe the other girl gave up because Maki took a sword, and so she couldn't do anything without a sword. <laughs> and... So, yeah, then Maki won against Mai, and okay, I, I see where Mai is coming from, that she dislikes Maki. <clears throat> so, basically, Maki is a talented one, but she has, like, no real source energy, uh, uh, curse energy. She can't see curses, so she has no curse technique, I think. So, it's all very just physical based for her, kind of like Rock Lee from... Naruto, right, where she has like no, where he has like no genjutsu or ninjutsu, he just has taijutsu. So I guess somewhat like that, I guess, right? And I mean, she also focuses on weapons and stuff, um, which is more like a mix of Ten Ten and Rock Lee, I guess. But okay, um, yeah, somewhat, somewhat like that, I guess, right? Where she's just like physical, strong, but not really anything else. But she is very talented in that regard. And so, that's something that Mai doesn't like, because she is not as talented, but all the burdens, pretty much, of being in the family got pushed on her, because Maki left. Makes me wonder, did, do they treat Maki badly because she left the family, or because she left the family and she had, like, no curse energy? I guess having no curse energy is also pretty bad, right? Because Jujutsu Sorcerer use curse energy to fight curses. So ha not having that, I guess, is pretty bad. And if you're in like a, a family that is like very big in that world, right? Um, 
So, yeah, I guess it's like both ways. She was treated bad because she had like no curse energy and then she left because she didn't like it there in the family. And then that also piled on of being treated bad even after she left. And because of that, all the burdens got pushed onto Mai, who didn't even want to be a Jujutsu Sorcerer. And she's not as talented, really. So, yeah. She has to do everything. She has all the pressure on her and has to be, like, really good and all that stuff to be seen as someone that is good, right? To have, like, a good standing in this world. And so, yeah, I can't see where her hate is coming from, but I think it's not really hate. <clears throat> I mean, she says she hates her, but I guess it's more like because she liked Maki as children, right? She liked her, she loved her, and now she just went away, broke her promise to to always be at her side and all that stuff, and now all the burdens got pushed on, on my. It's more like frustration and disappointment that results in the hate. I guess. Um, but it's not like hate, hate. Right, I guess. So yeah, I see where Mai is coming from, right? And overall, the fights in this episode were pretty good, I would say. Except that they did Nobara pretty dirty, like I said, with the shot. But yeah, I'm impressed how good Maki is. I mean, they said before that she was very strong with curse weapons and all that stuff, but that she pretty much fought two back-to-back and one and catch the bullet. <laughs> Man, Maki surprised me. And she's a second year. And I mean, Nobara also did pretty well. I mean, she fought a third year as a as a first year. So for that, I guess Nobara did pretty good. But I th I still think they did a dirty, uh, they did her dirty. Um, in the way how they knocked her out, basically. But yeah, that was the episode. So I guess next episode is Megumi and Kodo. And I guess this will be very interesting to see how that turns out. I I don't really care about the Megumi fight. <clears throat> I can't see it I can't see it going either way. Either Megumi wins or the other guy wins. Um but I'm interested to see how Itadori goes. Will how that how that will turn out. I can't see that Itadori maybe wins. But I could also see that Itadori maybe loses because Toto is supposed to be like one of the strongest. And um, I could also see that it might be a good point where they make Itadori lose so that it seem, that it's like a learning experience, right? That it shows he has still a lot to learn. So yeah, will be interesting. But if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. And I would say thanks for watching us next time. Bye-bye.